Hey guys, good evening. It is Wednesday, hump day. We're in the grocery store. Jill's has been coughing her brains out for pretty much the whole day today. I'm in my uniform. And she, has like, that I <laughs> she has like a couple minutes of relief here and there. So while she was okay, she decided to come to the grocery store to grab a few things. I would have went myself. Uh, but she wanted to get out of the house for a little bit, you know. So, we're just gonna grab some things. Maybe grab like a little pumpkin. He's, round. He's perfect. He's coming home with me. We really want to paint some pumpkins. Well, or carve some pumpkins. <clears throat> so, she wants to, I guess, I like him. He's use cute. a Sharpie He's on gonna him. come home with me. And, uh, <laughs> we just had a Starbucks coffee. We're gonna go home after and eat. Do a therapy. Excuse me, and then um, get ready for bed, I guess. Grocery shopping. There wasn't other people around. <laughs> I was dancing with myself. Shake it. <laughs> the tornado. It's therapy time. To look my hair. <laughs> it's like. All over the place. That was mine. <laughs> we're only doing one side because with the work we can. <laughs> so you guys don't usually with the board, see this. We can't. Right? What happened? So they don't usually see you coughing and stuff. Choking like a, I don't know. This is what a therapy looks like usually. This is one side, of course, and then we have other different positions we do about three, four minutes each. It takes about a half hour, 40 minutes sometimes. And then the nebulizers also. So. And Rosario just gave birth to me. Look, his legs are open. <laughs> Baboom, I popped out. <laughs> Baboom. Just <laughs> Rosario wanted me to show you guys our plant. See that plant? It's pretty big. <clears throat> and when we got it, it was just <clears throat> so tiny. And now it's like at least, I want to say, what, three, four feet maybe? Yeah. Rosario's father gave me uh, a little, bamboo? all four of them. Yeah, they were tiny, like not they fit even. In a little bag. They fit in a little bag. He brought them over for me right before I had my uh, first sinus surgery back in like 2010. Yep. I believe it was so January 2010. It's seven years old. And so, almost eight. Three months shy, two months, two and a half months shy of eight years old. And uh, yeah, that's how much it's grown. Yeah. This doesn't really do justice. If I put it on the floor, yeah. you'll be able to really see mm -hmm. how um, how big it is. But anyway, keep growing. Every time, my V is all primed up. Got the tubing here, and Jill's about to. Can't see the I'm tool. just flushing. About to flush. These are big syringes. My hands are only so big. About to flush my port, and that's pretty cool. It has a purple tint to it, and I like purple, so it's cool. Let me open the light so they can see better. Oh, that's much better. Yeah. And then there was light. Yep, so that goes into the port right here. A little bra over there, but it's okay. Just a tiny, tiny bit. <laughs> Count on this area to show um, you everything. Now we're going to hook this up. I'm going to show them how you hook that up to. Sure. Okay. This is sterile, so it hasn't touched primed. anything. So we're just gonna take that off. Oh, now I need an apple pen. Oh, touch them. It my hands just touched it. We have connection. It smells like cat urine, as everybody says, so I like to clean it because it stinks. It and it's all good. Making sure it's mine. <laughs> good afternoon, Rob. We are on our daily walk. We're pretty consistent. This is good. Yeah, yeah. I'm having a little good. before work 
I started my ball Snack. a little bit later today, unfortunately. I, I lost track of time. I'm like 15 minutes behind. Not terrible, but... Not too bad. Yeah. I'm not sure if they know about the uh, one hour before or one hour after rule. So even though it's supposed, supposed to be done to every eight, eight hours, hours, so let's say you do it at eight and then you do it again at four, you could technically do it at three or five. You could do an hour before, an hour after, and you're safe. So sometimes oh. we take advantage of that. Um, I had my needle change today, and we accessed the top port, and it's not really flush to my skin for some reason, and we couldn't figure out why, so we, uh, there was a little thing that was put there. It helps with infection and all that, and it gave me a little cushioning, so we put that there to help, so it's comfortable, and uh, I got to itch it, which was nice in between <laughs> changing needles. You guys have ever had a dressing on or whatever the itch is real so it's nice mm -hmm. yes i have my same sweatshirt on <laughs> change of pajamas Little pjs <laughs> yep change of pajamas i got pink on today and uh, that's really it still having some chest tightness it's like on and off so i don't know play it by ear and see <clears throat> no. My mouth was full. Oh, we're gonna get barked at again. <laughs> In the same spot. Very clear. Look at that. Beautiful out here. Yeah. It's like a blue sky, no clouds. He said no wow. rain for a while on the news, so that's nice. <laughs> He's just chilling with us. I'm having some eggplant. I got a text when I was at work that she was coughing up blood, so that wasn't fun. No, I had a nice bleeding episode and uh, chest tightness and it wasn't really fun, but uh, I'm trying to get some soup down. I really wasn't in the mood for anything for dinner, so uh, I got my little pumpkin friend here. Mm -hmm. I gave him some eyes and a nose yesterday. Toby's gonna eat a little something just to, you know, especially with all the pills just that she's IV. on and stuff. So. And the IVs. And the IVs, yeah. Make sure we get enough fluids in her, so. And forgot to mention, the electricity went out. And so, uh, oh, Jill yeah. went and got all the flashlights mm -hmm. and all that stuff. And we have a bunch of them inside also. I didn't know how long the lights were going to be out for and I my nebulizer was I was getting ready to shut it off in like two minutes and it went off on its own and I was like uh oh now what am I going to do because I still had three nebulizers left um, to do and I would have probably had my vest on doing my chest PT and um, within like 15 minutes of the electric going out I started coughing out a lot of blood. And so, um, I would have to stop my therapy anyway. And, uh, <coughs> Maybe it was good that it happened. So, sense, yeah, like, it was kind of like, at least I wasn't doing a therapy at least. So. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Everything happens for a reason. Hey guys, as you can see, we are in the dark. I have my phone light on me. Jill's not feeling too well. Her, um, head is hurting bad, and, um... Probably gonna give her a shot now. And she couldn't do a therapy, of course, because of the bleeding yesterday. So she just did albuterol and stuff. And uh, she's on the couch right there. Can't really see her. But there she is. And, um, yeah, this is pretty much our night right now because it's tough to. For her to move around and stuff when she's feeling like that, so I'm gonna give her a shot. Hopefully, the headache goes away, and um, it's almost IV time, so yep. Forgot to mention, we ordered some pizza, we had that for dinner, and um, some salad. Hello, vlog, happy Saturday. I look a little bit better than I did <clears throat> last night at this time, or whatever you want to say. Yeah, it wasn't a good night. Yeah, 
it was a bad night, but I was just going for a daily walk and uh, I'm still feeling like I'm in a cloud. I'm not feeling too good, but uh, <coughs> it's nice to go for a walk. And uh, we'll see how the night goes. Rosario called out of work just because last night was a mess and honestly, didn't I know didn't know what today was going to be like. And, uh, and I kind of kept him up the whole night and just, you know, so <clears throat> going for a walk and uh, Chihuahua's looking at us. That's really it. <laughs> oh. Chihuahua. Oh, a little Chihuahua. There's a little Chihuahua we pass every day. He's in the window. Usually he barks. He always <clears throat> barks at us. Now he Today maybe he he's bark. starting to know us. I don't know. Mm. <laughs> Who knows? But um, yeah. All right. We'll see you guys later. So guess what we're up to. Eating. <laughs> what else do we do? Of course, I get my usual sesame chicken. I Delicious. Got seaweed salad. Got seaweed salad. Okay, we'll just it. bottles in the way. And I got and some soup. She got soup. And, um, yeah, that's it. We just finished the therapy. Um, oh, Jill's so getting wondering. a little bit of a headache. And oh, so, head I hope that it doesn't go far. She took some meds. And, um, you guys saw early, we went for a walk. And it's just been another one of those days. Where got some Starbucks. Got Starbucks. But it's like on and off that she's feeling okay, then not okay, then, you know. I'm hoping that it'll eventually, um, get what's better. the word, get better or break or whatever. Turn the Just, corner yeah. and be better. Like a turnaround, pretty much. So, but for now, we're eating and we're enjoying that. And uh, see you guys but in I'm a bit. I'm still eating, I'm alive. Yep. So that means. When she doesn't want to eat, then that's not good. <laughs>